A four-year-old dies over the weekend from injuries he suffered while being severely beaten. Fox 29's Claudia Gomez live in Abington Township. Claudia, police are looking at someone pretty close to the child, aren't they? Yes, they are, Carrie Lee. As you said, this is a horrific story of child abuse. Police have arrested the mother's boyfriend in this case. They say he's the one who killed this child. And so while he's sitting in a jail cell, the mother of this child is making funeral arrangements. And here in Abington, police are still investigating, trying to figure out what led to this tragedy. It looks like any other suburban house, but for a little boy, it turned into a terrifying place, a place where his teenage caretaker called home. This man was, in fact, the child's nightmare. 19-year-old Nadir Turner is accused of beating the boy at least two different times last week. The list of the child's injuries is stunning. There was a skull fracture, three, at least three blows to the head, the forehead, right rear, and left side, two fractured ribs, uh, six and seven on the left side, uh, bruising on the back, both arms, face, and legs. Police say the child's mother was taking classes at Penn State's Abington campus and left her four-year-old with Turner, who is her boyfriend. Turner lives here with his mother and sister, who suspected something was terribly wrong. Uh, sister noticed that the child had bruises uh, on, on his body, and uh, she said, you know, how did this happen? And the little boy said that Nadir hit me. But she didn't call police, not even after investigators say the little boy begged Turner's mother to protect him. Turner grabbed the child and forcibly removed him, kicking and screaming uh, and crying, uh, and took him out the door. Police say Turner and the child's mother finally took the boy to Abington Hospital Thursday night, but it was too late. The cause of death was cranial cerebral injuries. In other words, the child's head was bashed in. And when you're seeing a small, helpless four-year-old child who obviously was terrorized by this person who didn't want to go with him. It just tears your heart out. As we said, Nadir Turner is sitting in a jail cell fa facing aggravated assault and endangering the welfare of a child. Those charges, though, anticipated to be upgraded. The DA says he very well may be filing murder charges against this man. Again, funeral arrangements pending while police investigate. But at this point, no one else is being charged. Reporting live in Abington, Claudia Gomez, Fox 29 News.